feature film. Okay, and the BAFTA for best feature goes to Ketchup. No, it's Paddington. <laughs> We are thrilled and delighted and amazed. Thank you so much to BAFTA and I'm sorry we have against the competition. Sorry guys on our table, but we're thrilled. <laughs> um, first of all, the first thanks must go to Michael, Gott, Michael Bond, who came up, of course, with the wonderful Polite Bear from Peru, lost and alone at Paddington Station. Um, huge thanks to the brilliant and lovely Danny Perkins and his team from Studio Canal, who backed us all the way. It was a very long journey, 10 years in the making of this film. Um, huge thanks to our brilliant producer, David Heyman, who can't be here tonight. But I know um, David would agree with me that the best thing we did on Paddington was to make it with our brilliant, brilliant, brilliant and very inspired writer, director, Paul King. And this is really for him. Thank you very much. Uh, amazing, great honor to win from such incredible competition and the idea of winning an award against Pixar is a bit ridiculous but very flattering and very lovely and I'd also like to thank my wife Eloise who's here tonight who was with me every step of the way we had our first date the week, the week I had my first meeting about Paddington and by the time the film came out we'd celebrated our second wedding anniversary so it was a long journey but well worth it so thank you very much indeed I'm very excited for you. I loved Paddington. Well done on your award. How do you Thank feel? You. Re really, really good. Just <laughs> so thrilled, actually. It's been a long journey, and it's it's very easy to sort of miss out on these awards in the end. So I'm just thrilled. And Paul has been brilliant. So we're really proud of him, and he's properly inspired writer and director. And he is what made Paddington as special as it is. You know when you see behind the scenes on films, particularly say a film like Men in Black, I remember Will Smith talking about how difficult it was to imagine the special effects being put in afterwards. A similar thing happened with what you guys did. How do the actors cope with that? Well, they're kind of amazing, but uh, they, we sort of try to help them as much as we can. We had, uh, you know, an actor reading in lines and we had sort of tried to have somebody at sort of Paddington's eye height most of the time. We had a brilliant actress called Lauren who's three foot six sort of roughly the same size as Paddington and and she worked with us a lot and we had this brilliant Spanish clown called Javier Marzan who's the funniest man on the planet so whenever he was doing physical things we sort of had something for them to react to but actors and actually Paul did a lot of Paddington <laughs> turns he was always yeah. popping in I was on my being Paddington on quite often Paddington station I remember with a fever of about 103 <laughs> going what has my life become <laughs> this is yeah, awful yeah. but um no it was it's so we sort of tried to help but I always think actors are amazing because they sort of have to ignore the fact there's a camera crew and a director and no set you know half the time you know there's sort of a wall behind them so a lot of the time they're kind of pretty good at pretending so they were they were able to and we had a there. wonderful animator called Pablo who has the eyes of Paddington. He has these deep brown pools of uh, wonderful, lovely, chocolatey eyes, which, uh, which was sort of ended up in the bear. <laughs> they certainly did, yeah. <laughs> How did you go about casting the film? Well, uh, it was a mixture of people uh, we'd sort of loved and admired for, for years and sort of also really fortunately some people that I worked with in the past, so uh, who sort of uh, were, I was so grateful to have come in. And uh, it was just a real sort of privilege. You always sort of hear about these things, especially on sort of proper movies, that it's sort of, oh, the studio made you have, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And it really wasn't like that at right. all. We just listed our favorite people and put them in it. And it was just terrific. And we were so lucky. And we were really lucky that Nicole Kidman just leapt at the opportunity because we did need a, a star to you know, help, help get the film out there. And she really threw herself into it. And I know, it was we a never joy. expected that, did we? Yeah. We just sort of sent her, and we sort of said, <laughs> who would you most like? And you kind of go, well, it's ridiculous, but <laughs> Nicole Kidman would be kind of amazing. They go, well, it's obviously not gonna be her, but we'll send her an email. And they emailed her agent, and, they, and her agent went, don't be ridiculous, but I'll put it to her. And then sort of phoned her, and Nicole just went, Paddington Bear? I love him. Oh. Terrible Australian accent. <laughs> and you get, and just with the agent's going, I don't know what this bear is, but she's on a plane. Wow. And she, we oh, met her about three days later because uh, she knew it from Australian Kids TV. 
Wow, it that's was, the power of kids' TV for you, it right? It really yeah, is. Yeah. It really is. I'm and not... those amazing animations, you know, those kind of ivory wood, they're so beautiful. And yeah. It really love it. It helps so many people, like, come on board. And, like, because sometimes when you're filming in the street, like, people get a bit annoyed if you've got, sorry, do you mind not driving past just for a minute? And, you know, kind of everyone's in a rush and you really understand it. Quite often people go, what's this for then? And then you go to Paddington, they all go, oh, oh all right then. I <laughs> do and they're just really happy. Can so I just say, because I've read this and I'm so excited, can you tell us anything about Paddington 2? Is there a... To tell is you, there we're trying to write it's it. It's going to be great. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. Paul's in the middle of it. Uh, yeah. And, uh, and, and what he's written so far is fantastic. I'm very excited. Yeah. There's more to come. There's more Yay. Adventures of the Bear. So. And is Nicole back? Uh, we... I don't want to say anything no. until I change my mind a hundred times about what the script should well, be. Well, me and her go way back. So Great. if you need me to put in a phone call, Fantastic. No worries. Maybe a body double, I think. You know, we often be. get confused I for each other. I can imagine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Very, very, very striking. Well, what a fantastic evening for you. We hope you enjoy the rest of the night. Oh, thank, thank you very much. much. Really thank, you. Thank, you. thank you so much. Uh, we'd really like to this year thank our crew that are so amazing at making this show with us. It's such a team effort. And it's an amazing crew, so we'd just like to thank them specially. When we, when we won a couple of years ago, thank you, um, I came on here and I squealed like a girl. So <laughs> Sam said, be cooler next time. 